Hey, what's going on there, YouTube? This is SEO0320 representing JBS. I'm about to do one more reaction to a new movie coming out called GOAT, starring Nick Jonas, James Franco, and somebody else. I think it's James Franco in this one. Either way, uh, this trailer is going to be uh, 2 minutes and 27 seconds. I've actually heard a lot about it, um, the buzz behind it. And at the same exact time, I'm curious to see Nick Jonas in a full-length movie, not just a TV show. Because I think that song in Scream Queens is actually pretty talented. But just in general, I mean, he's very talented. So I'm more curious about his role in this movie, more so than James Franco. But let's see where it's going. Dang, joint rated R. Disturbing behavior involving hazing, strong sexual content, nudity. Oh, God. Hey, Mom said you think about bailing on school. It's not bailing on it. Sports. You're accepted for the fall. Plus five six on the rushing in the fall. Dude, are you five six? I am, yeah. That's awesome. So what's up with rush? <laughs> Can anybody come out there? Yeah, of course. Yeah, we actually got a party on Saturday. This is five sigma mu. We're gentlemen. <laughs> I'm excited you're here. Because these are some of the best dudes I've ever known. You're going to be fly safe. We're going to do stuff with our lives. Well, they're not going to let you in here because you're my brother. You need to let them know you want to be here. Hello? Get your ugly goat ass to the house in 11 minutes or you're dead. Mom, you're picking up! Welcome to hell, we goats! Sir, yes, sir! Who was the first president? George Washington, sir! Wrong drink! Who shot John F. Kennedy? Uh, um, wrong drink! Guantanamo style, there we go. Look, I won't do this myself, right? They just do this to weed out the weak ones. Tell the boys gone and Wow. Is this pledge getting weirder? The pledge has got to go through hell. Otherwise, what's the point? Maybe you should just quit. Dude, if you quit, there's another guy that's been hacking. Dude, I'm having sex for the first time in my life. You know, I'm not stupid. That's not because of me. None of this matters at all. This matters to me! Look, we haven't been doing anything that every other fraternity on campus hasn't been doing. What's in your stomach? Me personally, I know the essence behind uh, fraternities and sororities, the kinmanship and the bringing together of a band of people trying to figure themselves out, especially going into college. You know what I'm saying? Like, you want to be able to belong, you want to be able to have somebody that's going to have your back. But one of the biggest things and the hurdles that people go through with that process is the hazing process of it, like the bullying, the bringing somebody down to nothing. Is it, I mean, it takes the simple concept of militarization. When you get when you get put into you know military, you have to go through boot camp and all this kind of stuff. The drill sergeant will grind you until you get to be a part of that unit. He will put you through hell. That's the reason why they talk about hell week. It's the same thing they try to transfer as far as the concept with um, fraternities and sororities, specifically fraternities. And with this one, this just embodies that. Like embodies the necessity part of why those dynamics happen, but what they can really do to deter deteriorate a person's morale, um, their essence about themselves. If you're already having self-loathing thoughts about yourself, dealing with hopelessness or dealing with depression, and you're being bullied and hazed to get to a point where you want to get next, you're going to do everything you can to get to that plateau. And some people lose their lives over stuff like that. Some people... Um, some terrible things do happen uh, when it comes to that process. Well, that's why me personally, I never actually joined a fraternity. Um, could have had opportunities to. I just know myself as a person. I know who I am. Not only I know who I am in Christ, but at the same time, I love people in general. Like Not that I'm, like, I was just a complete people person, but 
with different things I put myself in line with and organizations and media help, like I didn't necessarily need that. But for those that do need it, I think it's going to show the other side of this, you know what I'm saying? And I think that that could be a good thing and a bad thing uh, at the same time because people will have that going into the expectation going into like their freshman year or their sophomore year trying to join a fraternity or a sorority and it's it's unpleasant it really is and that shows the darker side of it and i think that james franco and nick jonas are doing great jobs as far as rose i'm not sure who the kid is playing nick jonas's uh younger brother or older brother or whatever but it's gonna be it's gonna be interesting i think i want to see it uh, it's just stuff like that, man. Like bullying in and of itself, like it saddens me, man. Like I, I hate people that get hazed. I hate people that get like brought down to nothing. Um, that's just not. That's that doesn't edify my spirit. You know what I'm saying? I, I wouldn't do that to somebody else. I couldn't. Matter of fact, I, I would put somebody through a training process, a training regimen, just like I was talking to my girlfriend about, like you know, like us working out and going to a training regimen. Um, but I would never callously put somebody through something like that to bring them down to nothing like yeah, that I don't know I just I just couldn't I understand the need to form into a unit but nah. anyway I'm sorry I went to this whole like philosophical perspective on it but it's, it's a really interesting film way the scope of it looks even before when I actually heard about it I was interested in it so definitely let me know in the comment section below what y'all think about the movie Goat keep it locked JVS for style hopefully y'all enjoyed this reaction peace